Hi, so this is a demonstration of the glove. So this is an infrared glove. Um, as you can see, we have a battery pack in the front. Okay, uh, we've wired it up to the three important fingers here. The index finger, which has the infrared LED, and then the thumb and the ring finger, uh, which actually complete the circuit to turn on um, the LED, taking advantage of natural human movement. Watch, do that again for the camera. There you go. And un undo it a couple times. There you go. So as you can see, uh, the human um, hand is actually part of the circuit. You are the switch. It's a very natural interaction um, and, and pretty easy to explain to someone once and suddenly they get that's a click. Okay, let's see it in action. Here we go. Here we are on Google Maps. As you see, you can sort of pinch and grab something and pull it towards you. So you can also interact with your windows using this. Um, all sorts of cool interactions possible. And it's, it's very human as opposed to a pen or a remote or some other sort of uh, hardware that you hold in your hand. This actually is your hand. You have, you know, very free uh, motion and movement possible. bit difficulty here. Spinning the globe is, of course, one of the most fun things you can possibly do with this thing. It's, it's fun. We have taken a geography lesson and found France. <laughs> and now that we're in France, we're demonstrating uh, the Wiimote, which is actually the same principle, um, probably a little bit simpler, actually, because it's basically a candy dispenser, uh, as explained earlier, and uh, has an infrared LED at the tip. Pretty easy button. Okay. Go to town. Yeah, works a bit better actually if you're aiming it at the uh, if you're aiming it at the remote. Oh look, it's the Eiffel Tower. In three D. In three D. Say. It's a little bubble. Out. Ooh, look. Modeled by Google. Awesome. Your world in 3D. Very cool. Mm. Oh, I feel your finger a little more. Whoa. I like I think the shadow. We're in the Eiffel Tower. Now. Yeah, we're inside of the Eiffel Tower from Google. <laughs> I like that. Oh, we're yeah. back here again. We know that. I saw a video online of this guy. Where's, what is this thing? Like, dropped there? a paper airplane from the top of the Eiffel Tower and watched it fall. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Okay. Wound up, like, really far away. Yeah, I love the shadow going on. Yeah, that shadow. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Must be by an airplane. <laughs> 